。美國總統拜登星期二表示，俄羅斯聲稱部分兵力撤回基地嘅說法冇得到證實。Remains right now, Russia has more than 150,000 troops encircling Ukraine and Belarus and along Ukraine's border. An invasion remains distinctly possible. 拜登反驳咗普京关于美国同北约威胁俄罗斯嘅说法，佢再次警告俄罗斯入侵将付出巨大代价。We are not seeking direct confrontation with Russia, though I've been clear that if Russia targets Americans in Ukraine, we will respond forcefully. 美国参议院少数党领袖麦康奈尔再次呼吁美国政府立即制裁俄罗斯。防止其進一步入侵。普京星期二表態講，俄羅斯唔希望喺歐洲發生戰爭，不過佢依然堅持唔應該允許烏克蘭加入北約。北約星期三表示，沒有跡象顯示俄羅斯在緩和局勢。We have heard the signs from Moscow about readiness to continue diplomatic efforts. But so far, we have not seen any de-escalation on the ground. On the contrary, it appears that Russia continues the military build-up. 美国国防部长奥斯汀当日响布鲁塞尔参加北约会议，同成员国嘅国防部长讨论如何阻止莫斯科进一步入侵乌克兰。欧盟星期三督促俄罗斯采取实际行动缓和局势。Russia has signaled that it may be open to diplomacy. And we urge Russia to take concrete and tangible steps towards the escalation, because this is the condition for sincere political dialogue. 俄罗斯国防部星期三公布视频表示，俄罗斯战机响白俄罗斯进行演习